Hi, I'm Michael Burton with MichaelBurtonFilms.org, located in Salt Lake City, Utah, and we're here talking about Internet Essentials. Now I want to talk to you about how to add a YouTube video to your website. Okay, to add a YouTube video to your website can be done in a couple of different ways. I'm going to go ahead and show you a couple that I know of. Uh, first, I've gone ahead and pre-opened a Macromedia Flash uh, program file here that I have for my current website at MichaelBurtonFilms.org. Um, I'm going to show you how to place a link to a YouTube video on your website uh, in Flash. Uh, for example, if we take this section here uh, where it says 2008 wedding trailer, click to play, you notice the dotted line underneath. That is because I currently have this text linked to a certain video that I have on my website. Now, if we wanted to get a link from, let's say, a, a, a YouTube site, uh, let's go down here to the Start menu first. We need to get our link first. Let's go up to Internet Explorer. Click on that. We'll open Internet Explorer. Now let's let's go up here and we'll type in YouTube.com. Let's go ahead and when YouTube pulls it up, we'll search for this is a music video that I shot a little while ago for a group called Gale Song. So we will search Gale Song and it appears that it's the very first one right here. Uh, so let's go ahead and click on this. And then we'll, uh... okay, so now while this is kind of playing through here, if you notice up here at the, at the right-hand side over here, I'm sorry, over here, uh, you see that it says URL and embed. This is the embed code. So what we're going to, well, we want the URL because this is the URL to go to this video clip. So what we're going to do is we're going to copy this. This is for a link. Okay, and now we're going to go ahead and close down YouTube. Now what we're going to do is we're going to choose now, depending on which text you want on your website to be linked, it can also be an image as well. We're going to go ahead and do text. Um, if you want a certain text to be linked to, to another web page or URL, what you're going to do is you're going to highlight the text, just like this. We're, let's, let's go ahead and highlight this Michael Burton production specializes in. Once you highlight down here in Flash, it's very, very simple. If you come down here to the very bottom, there's a little like link icon right here. This is where you're going to type in the address, or in our case, we can just right click and click paste. Now that has completely copied the URL. The one important thing that you need to remember when, when pasting a link in any program, not just uh, Flash, is that you need to always have the HTTP semicolon backslash backslash www and then to your link. You've got to have the HTTP in there or it does not recognize it um, as a link. Um, go ahead and click off that. Now, as you return up here to uh, to your web page, you notice that the Michael Burton Productions specializes in is is underlined now. That means that that text is linked. So when we export this and up and publish it and upload it to our web page, then we will have this as a link, and people can click on this text. Uh, to access the YouTube video. Now another way that you could do this is, for example, we're going to go ahead and use a blog as an example. I've gone ahead and pulled up my blog under Michael Burton Productions. It's michaelburtonproductions.blogspot.com and if we wanted to embed this video into our blog spot, it works the same way with a website. I just thought I'd show you this other example. We're under right here where it says edit HTML and compose. We're under the edit HTML. Since this will be a form of HTML, you want to, when you're going to embed a video into your website, you want to embed it into the HTML. Now let's go ahead and bring back up our Gale Song uh, music video here. And we're going to go ahead and right here on the right hand side under URL, there's a code for embed. We're going to, we're going to highlight that code and we're going to right click and copy. Now let's go ahead and bring back up our blog and in our blog, we're going to right click and paste the code into our blog. Now, and again, it'll be done the same way in, the, in your website. Then you're going to go ahead down here to publish post. We're going to publish the post. Now we can view our blog. So now as we view our blog, you'll notice that at the very top, it'll just take a second to load, here's, is our YouTube video. And here it is. So now you can click on it to get it to play and it's embedded right into your website. And again, you can do this not just on a blog, but you can do this to any website that you currently have. 